Hi, I'm Eric Mitten, Technical Product Manager at Nordic Semiconductor. Nordic Semiconductor is a company specializing in low power wireless communication for IoT. And ML is greatly interesting for us in order to do edge processing and get the most value out of the data that we collect from our sensors. Our demo is about say, sensing uh, motion and transferring over Wi-Fi. So we run this uh, demo on our Thingy 53, which is a dem uh, prototyping platform uh, with the Thing uh, 5340 SoC and all the sensor you need for basically any use case. It has a rechargeable battery and uh, the point of the demo is to, to run uh, this uh, run inference on uh, battery power devices. For the demo, I'm going to start by turning it on. Starts blinking. And I'm going to connect to it. And it's connected. We can do various things with this. Uh, we can do data acquisition, push a button, and this will use the accelerometer. I start sampling, I can shake it for a few seconds. And I have a data sample transferred to a phone. What we can also do is run inference on the device itself. So if I start it, I will just hold it very still. And it will say it's idle. I can move it up and down. I'll set a snake. Uh, it's up and down, and it says up and down, and we'll stop. So that's the demo running over Bluetooth. What we've been working on lately is to integrate uh, this product into our demo, which is the first Wi Fi product we put on the market, the NRF 7002. This is the NRF 7002 expansion board, which fits into the Thingy 53. Now I'll turn on the Thingy. Uh, 53 with the Wi-Fi expansion board and it will look for a uh, hotspot and connect. It's flashing the blue LED. Now it's fine, it's now it's flashing green. And let's put it next to my computer screen which shows uh, a simple studio, my devices on the device list and there's a green dot showing that we have connection. With that simple studio, you can do the same thing, you can do data collection and you can do, uh, get their inference results.